Man, that wasn't pleasant. I'm happy that wasn't on camera. Hey there, one the cell cow. I'm trying to select yes, but it's not. Yes, yes, yes. Did I enable sound? I don't know. I guess we're gonna find out as we're loading images. Yeah, see, I'm not getting sound. I am not. I want sound. How can I get help? Get me sound. Uh huh. Alright, control shadow. By the way, hi there, everyone. It's Galbling. Shadow, shoot! It's 2006 at the ring. <laughs> okay, it's the ring. Got it. This is like different things. Got it. Whatever. Chasm. Found the chasm and it's over. How do I enable sound? I want sound. Alright, well, after hammering on this for a while, I can't get the sound to work, so I guess we're gonna play without sound. Like, it says sound should be going, but it's not. So here we go, Diamond Highway. <laughs> this is starting 2006 pretty good. So, sorry about that, but, like, I just, I don't know. Like, uh, free J2 I ME mean, normally, typically, just kinda goes, but here... I'm not having sound, so I'm not having sound. Here we go in the universe. So yeah, you got you press five uh, to on your keyboard to shoot your little gun, and you also you like press the side buttons on your um. Okay, so while I'm in ball form, I say like, I'm not afraid of those spikes. Got it. Um. But you also use your keypad to move up and down, so yeah, I can see this creating problems. This looks pretty rad though, like honestly, this looks alright. And you can shoot mines too. You know what, I'm, I'm used to Z's game being pretty awkward. Okay, so there's a big old pit, don't fall there. This is honestly pretty neat. Uh, I pressed the shoot button there and there's a... You need to press it with vigor with interest all right you get a little counter there look at that i got multipliers uh, i'm gonna multiplicate here we go time to do math all right here we go over those mean old arrows frame rate is a bit hard on the eyeballs but i think that's to be expected yeah see i pressed the button and then he, sh he shot like there is uh, a delay you gotta live with all right then you get to the goal Oh man, oh my gosh, it's a robot driving some kind of tank. Like, I don't know how else to describe this. It has a health bar. I cannot, like, go forward. I think that's worth noting, and I can't jump. So I guess what I'll do is I'll sit here and shoot in front of me, because as long as I'm in my lane, I'm going to shoot whatever is summoned in front of me. And I'll just shoot him whenever he gets in front of me. Alright, I figured it out. I figured out this boss. Mr. Blue Driver, here with the news. This is really silly. Alright, well, um... He's got a drill on his seat, you know? He's ready to do any mining that might be happening, like, above him. Like, if he crosses under a low bridge or something, he is ready to create some clearance. Uh, you got a sweet like picture of Shadow there in the bottom. That's pretty rad. Everyone's into that. Yeah, all right. Uh, there'd be like some kind of jingle of victory. And this might be like I tried to look up on the internet if this was a known issue, if there was a workaround. It's nearly impossible to find anything looking for a Shadow shoot. <laughs> Uh, I got a lot of, like, shadow recording. Well, here's the pirated tunnel. Yeah, let's try and blast through the game, I guess. So we're, like, in some kind of, like, crazy, like, little, like, fun little place. You know, one of those things. So what if I just sit here and shoot all day long? Oh, but see, then there's this. But then that's fine. Now I can stay here and just, like, twirl all day long. Oh, see? The helicopters were replaced by little pond things. Oh, and the mines are moving. The mine of the manor. I don't know what that means. Uh, very, very much effort there. And that mighty ramp jump. Look at that. Sticking to the middle. Uh, where it's relatively safe. Yeah. Uh, I feel like the level just repeated here. That's fine. Look at that. Yeah, multipliers. I do not know what is being multiplied. It does not matter. 
Well, then that guy could have been... Uh, okay, so can I don't think you can move while you're airborne. Um, so something to consider. It's a big old Metroid door. The big difference it does is nothing at all. It shoots stuff that might be in my way while it moves back and forth there every... Oh, I just kind of walk right back in the laser there. All right, so that's what makes it different. Sometimes it has a big laser, and it's like, eh, yeah, it's laser time, and I'm like, all right, the laser casts a shadow on the ground. I mean, that's handy, because then I know where it is. <laughs> it's not very realistic, but I am okay to see the things from reality if it makes it a little bit more playable, you know? I, that will always be my take in these things uh, forever and a day. Destruction of stuff. Uh, it's got like that rotating graphic in the middle to indicate that it's a rotating device. Very exciting. Uh, so, whoops. Well, I just kind of walked into that. Like, I just walked right into that. I did not wait for the laser to go. So the timer is for both the stage and the boss. That makes sense. But I get the feeling that the timer is like might be what get in the way of being a bit too cheesy with your approaches there look at those rocket skates now these are flat out explosions under his shoes they are not like laser blades uh, coming through your face all right period tunnel clear you get score and everything uh, time that uh, it's time remaining not time spent gotta load those images yeah yeah jdi for oh i see it's like some kind of metal and then a location. All right, diamonds, a well-known metal. Here we go. This is like Green Hill Zone, kind of. All right, dodge the milkshake. All right, I want to get spinny. All right, and then you get dizzy. There you go. So now we got like little RD2 bots serving as Earth Defense Force. It's pretty good. If we find a giant ant, we know who to get. Gonna get these rings. That's right. Yeah, look at that airborne ramp zone. Just re oh geez. Yeah, see, that's what I was saying. When you're you're airborne, you cannot like move. So if the timing is bad and you're heading towards a pit, you gotta do something about it, right? So this is the part where the level repeats. Oh, I thought I would have hit the boost and become ball. That was not the case. This is a very tile-based game. Uh, I, I gotta point it out because it's very subtle about it. All right, look at that. Super jump. See, you don't even need, like, to be on a big red mood to have a nice big jump. It's just the blue thing, though, is going to completely eradicate the mood. And you just don't jump when you're sad, all right? That's the reason why in the Olympics, everyone's always happy. All right, it's boss time, Mr. Guy. It's a big tank. All right, so spews enemies. So that's new. All right, goes up and down like I do. Like, we are very similar. He also has a laser. Oh, but he scans it. All right, there you go. Figure it out. When he does that, you move out of the way. Whoa. See, I wonder, I think this is kind of an okay way of doing it. It's just that, like, all right, so do you move? Yeah, like that. Like, do you want to move with him? Like, I feel like you're just going to hit his, like, stuff all the time if you do that, right? No? All right, so he's going to do there. Here we go. You did it. Because, yeah, now I'm, I'm a slightly little bit concerned about the time limit. Yeah, like, he's just, like, throwing out garbage all day, every day, regardless. You just gotta get your guns on and get your move on. Get your groove on. Get your potato skins ready for mealtime. If you can help it. If you can't help it, I mean, that's fine. It's just that, you know, Aunt Gertrude is gonna be really disappointed. In this. If you're able to live yourself like that. I mean, that, that's fine. That's pretty cool of you. And that probably makes you the better man. But uh, we're gonna quell the subject as I just talk in complete silence and it's awkward for absolutely everyone. Hey, there's eight levels. That's number three. Da -da 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 -da. I mean, that's pretty rad. I just don't know how playable it is on the plane. Pearl Mountain, the mountain of pearls. Yeah, Pearl, my favorite metal. Here we go, it's ice, uh, it's the mountain. Here we go, I got a gun. It's a little light, a bunch of pixels. Whoa, snowman, be careful out there. And robots, snowman and robots, what will we do? Jump over the world for me and you. Just kind of move right into that guy. 
barely even go in the try yeah like you're probably supposed to like go for combos and whatnot and like you know maximize going through a bunch of things and then you don't want to get hurt and all that i'm fairly content trying to survive like i don't know if that's the correct way to go but it's the attitude i have decided to foster for myself for better or for worse so that yeah Oh shoot, yeah, I just I just keep doing the exact same mistake. And it is the exact same mistake, because the level repeats. Hey, look at that! Oh, I thought he was walking. Oh, he's got like a missile thing in the way, and it's like a shield? I don't know. That's his deal. He's, he's like the first boss, except he has a little friend. No, it's, he's called Missile Jim, and he gets in the way, man. So, strictly speaking... By being in the middle, where they're most likely to... Oh, and he does that sometimes. That's good to know. I don't want to die. Uh, I won't die. So if the missile just kind of stops randomly... Yeah, like, you kind of want to not be in the middle then. Because they meet up in the middle. Like, if you want to... Ma if your only goal is to maximize DPS, hang out here on the side. <laughs> yeah, this is probably the easiest boss. I don't know, maybe not. Like, maybe I just looked out into the exact sequence that lets you speedrun this game. Look at that sweet, weirdly blurry, very artifact image of Shadow. Ah, it's beautiful. Put it on the internet. Time, 122. Here we go. Levels are happening. Uh, Calcite Hill. When I think about precious whatevers that you're going to put in jewelry, calcium is where I immediately go. Here we go, here we are in the world. Oh man, there's all these birds though. Yeah, birds and tanks. Yeah, that's the Shadow the Hedgehog, all right. Here we go, destruction! Moving the ball. And then, like that tank takes multiple bullets. Like it's like a tank or something. Wild, yeah, that, oh. Okay, okay, I can get to... This is where the level's getting shorter and shorter. Like, I don't know if they are, but they certainly feel that way. Like, there was a point where I feel like I was just, you know, I was like sub one minute by the time I ended. But at this point, I don't know, like, like I'm almost at the end there, you see? Like, you got like a progress bar in the bottom of the screen. Because <laughs> that's something this game needs. Alright, from start to goal, here we go. Da 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 na 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 I am the robot that summons things. And I have a missile friend. But I keep moving while my missile is there. Oh, see, so you go where there's no missiles then. Alright, I get it. Someone took the time to draw that pretty cool, like, missile graphic at this point. And they're like, well, hey team, we're gonna have to start using that sweet missile graphic to do things. And then, you know, Jim was like, yeah, but I had to draw that cool, like, beam attack. You told me we could have the cool beam attack of every boss. I'm like, hey, hey, don't worry. We're gonna have both. And then many high fives were exchanged, because that is, you know, that's, that's the only way to make a Shadow of the Hedgehog game, is if a lot of high fives are happening. I got hurt at some point. Doesn't matter. Nothing matters. And that's why, that's what matters. What matters is that nothing matters. All right, I need to like, yeah, I got I got hit by that tank. I walked right into that tank zone. I did that. Yay, and he blew up. I got one ring out of this. Well, I survived with one. I had a lot more ring. Remember, you're moving with the keypad, you know, up and down. And you press five on the keypad to shoot. I, I want, and remember, your hands are like less than an inch away from the screen. Carnelian? Or is, we're going really obscure here. Like so, Sapphire, Emeralds, who cares about those? The Shout a Hedgehog, he's back at Radical Highway. We're gonna get Carnelians involved. Oh, what? Oh, I guess I ran out of juice. Uh oh, I might die here? Yeah, I died. Game over. All right, so you got one life. But then you just come back, so it's fine. All right, so things might start to get more complicated, which, you know, oh shoot, I, this did not happen the way I thought it was gonna be. All right, here we go, do a mighty leap, yeah. Do a mighty, just run forward, no, yeah, super yeah, uh-oh. 
See, look at that. See, that was being tricky because they put they put a blue thing like right there. They knew. They knew, man. Oh, I wanted to go down, but I didn't. All right. Yeah. I feel like a lot of like high level shadow shoot essentially involves memorizing the level layout. Um, like I feel like there's just no real way around. Did the level pause to load there to load the second loop? Like, I didn't recall that happening with the other ones, but that very much looked like what happened. Oh, whoops, alright, that's fine. I don't need to press any button. Whoa, how does that? Well, alright. Well, that's maybe fine. No, it's not. No, it's not. I need more of that in my life. Whoa, wait, what? Why did I game over? Really? Uh, well, <laughs> all right, finally, I'm at the boss. Hey, look at that. It's a big old donut. It's, it gives me a big, like, that fire wheel thing from Blaze Phoenix stage. Alright, so it summons a laser missile pretty quickly, and then it just kind of fires, and I guess that's what we're going to be expecting from this dude. Yeah, and his big gimmick seems to be that he, sum like, he tries to summon it so that it's in your way, which... Like, look at that. Like, he just kind of also just generally hangs out where you are, which makes him one of the, like, most... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for here? I don't know. Like, bosses that just... Most convenient bosses, I guess. Because he's, like, he's trying to go into range of getting shot in a weird way. So thank you. Like, after a kind of annoying level, we had a very considerate boss. This is how you can demonstrate the relationship between yin and yang. Totally. Alright, load all of those things. This is the Amethyst Castle 1. There's two Amethyst Castles. Finish. Alright, ooh, look at these tiles. Alright, well, here we go. We're gonna start skating. We're gonna start shooting. Oh, is this a boss rush? Oh. Okay. Sure. So I guess I just encountered the maximum in level abilities for uh, the level I just beat, huh? Or maybe there could be a real level after this one. I don't know. Like, I'm already at the goal. It's very weird. Like, let's see what happens, I guess. Yeah, he blows up. It's pretty cool. Okay, yeah, and loads in a new boss. Alright, that... Oh. Yeah, I, I guess maybe the loadings, because he needs to load in, like, these new sprites. Like, they're completely different new graphics, right? Normally, they recycle all these enemy attacks from, from like, graphics that would already be in memory from when they loaded the game. Yeah, 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 that would make sense. Uh, yeah, there we go. I got damaged. It happens. It's gonna happen. These bosses, by virtue of spinning enemies at you all day long, and the enemies being spat, giving you rings all day long means you're functionally invincible. Which might mean that, ironically enough, one of this, one of this like, level 7 might be one of the hardest levels to die in because of this. It's pretty funny to think about. Alright, where are we at now? Hey, it's Mr. Wheelie Face. It's Mr. Wheelie Face. Space is that as a wheel. Please move around faster, because I can shoot you faster. That's just how it works. It is. Like, that's that's the funny part. Yeah, look at that. You just died. It, well, I think these boss rush enemies have less health, which is smart. Like, that's a weirdly smart move from, from this game. Like, it's easy to be dismissive about, about, about mobile game, but, like, that is something more common games should do. If you have a boss rush that you revisit bosses, make them, like, make them go a bit faster. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm at this castle, too. Here we go. Look at that ziggy-zag background. Beautiful. I lost my hair. Okay, well, I'm way at the start of the S, so this might not be a boss rush. We just had a boss rush, and now we have a level. Alright. Okay, sure. 
you know what? They wanted eight. They didn't know what to do. So they were like, ah. And someone on the team was like, ah, sure. I'm going to eh that you back. And uh, that is how game development happens. Probably. Look at that, though. I'm running. Whoosh. That's right. Destruction. Sometimes. Oh, I ran out of being in ball form. Now we're at a midpoint, so maybe this will go okay. So look at that, our dude. Oh shoot! Okay, I couldn't move there. Ah, I, like I almost got trapped there. You know, I might have died. I mean, it, it's gonna happen. Like that's kind of like what the game does: is that it sets up situations, and then you might die. Ooh ah, uh, ooh ah. Uh. I don't know. I got Caramel Denson in my head, and I don't know why. Why would Shadow Shoot inspire Caramel Denson? The world is full of mysteries. <laughs> Alright, hey, it's loading time. Alright, look at that. It's Robotnik in his clown mobile. He's got his floor waxers here, ready to wax that floor. Here we go. His special gimmick. All the missiles with all the lasers. While making sure the floor is spotless. Look, uh, there's a lot of maintenance to be made in all his space bases he keeps building. I can see how he would try to be practical for once and just equip weaponry to his maintenance vehicles. Well, you'd think that, though, he would let robots do the maintenance. Uh, part of me th would not be surprised if uh, Robotnik was not afraid to get really hands down and get that done. And I think I beat the game. I just bought this for two dollars on my phone and look, that took me 20 minutes. Which fair like it's fair I guess and then you would play again you know try to go for a high score I got like three units of score that are just completely ignored because I was playing bad oh no uh, uh, uh. oh no I dropped my chaos emerald and it's the fourth one say line shadow well you can't say line. hey that that sprite was some sonic battle you win oh boy Dead. <laughs> That's all right. This is kind of sad. Dead. Woohoo! What? Oh, there we go. I pressed the button, and it's loading images. Yeah! Shadow shoot! Shadow shoot! 